Hey, what's up guys and gals? I'm going to be doing a video, like, sort of, not my initial reaction, but instead a sort of discussion as I watch the trailer over again of, um, Justice League's new, um, sneak peek or Comic Con release of a trailer. And now we're starting off and we see these people walk into Diana's museum, seemingly, trying to, I don't know, brutalize innocence? It doesn't, I don't think they're trying to steal anything unless they are and maybe they're art thieves looking for a quick buck on the black market but nonetheless Wonder Woman comes in fucks up the door just like in Wonder Woman yeah <laughs> she must have a thing against doors if there's gunned or armed people on the other side of it um there's this person talking to her like you do anything this weekend and she's like nah not that interesting and that's pretty funny I wonder if people know she's one woman in this universe. And we learn that Batman hasn't been seen in Gotham. And people are like, where is he after his big, big fucking arrival in BVS? Um, Wonder Woman and Batman, or Wonder Woman and um, Bruce are talking on the ship about the Age of Heroes coming. And it will come, but we need to hurry. And then we get a pan out view or pan in view of Femmaskira, which is beautiful before we um, come to its mother box and a boom tube arriving right alongside it, delivering none else than Stefan Wolf. Who will fuck shit up undoubtedly? The Aquaman swimming up to seemingly the king's armor, who or which he will take to fight the armies of Parademons and Stefan Wolf himself, as he'll be stepping up to the plate for the first time. We see all these members of the Justice League turn around or sort of look in despair, maybe lost in the world. But as Stefan Wolf gives a speech of no Kryptonians, no Green Lanterns, this world is vulnerable, this world will fall. <laughs> after he gives a little I don't know a little teaser towards penguins saying oh yeah well, you used to be worried about exploding penguins now we got a fucking alien invasion with a war a god of war it seems and as we saw parademons and Stefan Wolf regrouping on their ship we saw the Justice League regrouping but in a much more friendlier way in a much more unknowingly way because they don't know each other they don't know what they're going to do but they're certainly going forward and we see Flash's sort of innocence saying yeah it's really cool you guys can fight but I've never fought all I do is grab and move people and this is where we see Cyborg actually try and or actually hack into Batman's tunnel vehicle and he's going to wreck shit um, before seemingly Stephen Wolf gr um, jumps onto the machine and destroys it Batman's monologue about Superman, how he was a true hero, how he l allowed people to see themselves for who they really are and see a bright light. We see some action. Seemingly, that is Apocalypse they are on. The Justice League standing side by side. A beautiful shot of Diana jumping for a sword and flash, touching the tip to edge it towards her. <laughs> Aquaman riding a fucking parademon <laughs> through a building. And the fame scene that we got described to us early last year about how Batman and the others meet to talk about scientists that went missing. Cyborg adds Silas Stone to the list. Before they all disappeared, they go chase after a nest. And Flash is left saying, ah, well that was rude. How <laughs> they vanish and then just run off. And Gordon is left confused. And now we end. We actually end with... A very, a very scary scene in my opinion, as Alfred looks over his shoulder after noticing his alcohol, like, or maybe apple juice, I don't know, glass, actually shake, and uh, look at Superman and say, he said you'd come, let's hope you're not too late. Really looks like he's a very scared man in that scene, but I don't know, I might be just stupid. Thank you guys and girls for watching, please remember to like, comment, subscribe, I'll see you in the next video, bye.